Painting most metals is quite simple. You can just clean them and then paint them using a normal primer and then a normal top coat. Galvanized steel, like this, is a little bit more complicated. You need to apply another primer first before you apply your normal primer. Unless you get a special dedicated galvanized steel paint. A lot of paint will not stick properly to galvanized steel. First of all, I'm going to clean the surface using some methylated spirits and a clean rag. That will remove any grease, oil or dirt that's on the galvanized steel. I'm then going to apply some Zinzer Bullseye 123 Plus using a small roller. That will be drying about 30 minutes. Once I've done that, I'm going to spray some surface primer and then finally a top coat. So I've now put some chemical gloves on. I've got a clean rag and some methylated spirits. And we're just going to give this a clean. I've now mixed the Zinzer Bullseye 123 Plus thoroughly and I've emptied some into this roller tray. So I'm now just going to roll in the metal and give it a good prime and then this will be ready for the actual dedicated metal primer that we're going to use. So that'll be dry in about 30 minutes. Once it's dry we can then continue with the primer spray. I'm now going to prime the metal using Rust-Oleum Surface Primer. Before you use this, you need to give it a good shake for at least a minute. Once you've given it a good shake, you can then proceed to spray the metal. Once you spray that, you should invert the can and give that a spray and that will clean out the nozzle ready for next time. Now that the primer is dry, we are now ready to apply the top coat and we will be using this Painter's Touch in a blue colour. So I've given the can a really good shake for a couple of minutes and now I'm going to spray it using really light, short bursts so that we don't get any runs. And again, when you've finished, you need to invert the can and spray it and that will clean out any paint from within the nozzle and it'll stop it from clogging up in future.